How's it going everybody? Rob Riker here, instructor and mentor at NextGenT. In this video, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at the Cisco Certified Technician or CCT certification. So what is CCT? CCT is an entry level certification that Cisco has, they've been out for a while actually. And the cool thing about it is if you're just getting into networking, like I mean, just getting into networking, like you've never, you don't know what an IP address is or like what's a switch? This is a great because it starts off at the base foundations and then it grows from there. So you're like, but Rob, what about the CCNA? Good point. CCNA is like here. You should have a base level of understanding when you get into CCNA. I already kind of know some things. That's kind of the expectation of CCNA. CCT is more like right here, where you don't really know what an IP address is or what's a switch? Like what's layer two? So these are things that you're gonna wanna ask yourself. Do I know this? Do I know that? If you wanna go and dive into those things, hey, by all means, go ahead and knock it out. But if you're in a situation where you're like, I don't know anything about networking. Hey, I was there once too. Yeah, I've got a CCIE, but you know what? There was a point in time where I thought CCNA was gonna be like, I'm never gonna pass it. It took me three times to pass. So it's a no joke certification. With that being said, this is where CCT comes into play. We need to understand what it covers. The focus of CCT is to focus on the basics, right? You're gonna be a, the, the title being technician, right? You're gonna be going to a site where Cisco equipment, router switches, firewalls are gonna be deployed. So your goal and your job would be to physically go to somewhere and be able to identify a router, identify a switch. Maybe you've got somebody on the phone that's in, in the engineering team and they're saying, hey, we need you to take this box that's in the box. Like you have the, the box, the switch, the box. That's what we call a device, a box. And then you have the cardboard box that the box comes inside of. You see where I'm going with this. You take the box out of the box and you put it in the rack cable it up, you power it on, but maybe there's no config on it. Well, how do, what do you do then? Well, guess what? Because the CCT covers these type of things, you can actually look at the config that's on the existing device, copy it off. Maybe you've already got a copy from the engineering team that they sent you in a text file. You copy and paste that into the CLI, you save the config, boom, you're alive. How cool is that, right? These are things that the CCT is going to help you understand and be able to work with. This is why it's, it's, a, it's powerful. The thing that a lot of the server upper level certifications miss, and this is critical for anyone that's gonna be doing technician level stuff, even architects, right? The guys that have been doing networking and whatever else for 10 years or more, myself included. What is the number one thing that you have to do as an entry level person? You gotta put your hands on the gear. Putting your hands on the gear can be intimidating. Well, you know what? We don't wanna make it intimidating. We want it to be like, oh yeah, no big deal. Pick up a laptop, pick up a, a PC, same concept applies. Did you know a router and a switch is actually a computer with no GUI that you would click around inside of? It's still a computer, still CPU, still RAM, still an operating system. It does something, right? And that's something that you definitely wanna pay attention to when you're trying to understand what it is that equipment does. So CCT focuses heavily on those details. When it comes to focusing on the CCT routing and switching, which for those of you that are following the new Cisco paradigm shift in their certification program, the CCNA has replaced, the new CCNA, the 200-301, has replaced all the pre-existing certifications, right? So they're all gone, right? The CCNA security, CCNA routing and switching, CCNA service provider, done, finito, bye-bye. Well, with that being said, the CCT route switch is going to provide that base level foundation. Do you remember the CCENT, the Cisco Certified Entry Level Network Technician certification? Hey, guess what? This is basically that certification. So if you want something to start off with that is Cisco focused, that's not Network Plus, but isn't quite as intimidating or that big, that big beast that CCNA is, CCT is the way to go. It's a much smaller certification. You get 55 questions, it's about 120 bucks to register at Pearson View in order to take the exam. It's doable, right? And that's the thing that we wanna pay attention to. So what does CCT cover? CCT covers four different areas. You've got the general networking knowledge, which is about 25% of the certification. You have Cisco equipment and related hardware, which is about 20%, which is those two in and of itself are huge. Being able to identify a router, identify a switch, and being able to tell the difference between the two. That's a big deal. Cisco iOS software operation, how does iOS actually work? That's important to understand as well. And then service related knowledge, that's about 26%. So when you tally them all up, you get 100%, right? And that's what you wanna pay attention to. Make sure you understand each bullet item in the blueprint as you are looking at what it is that you're gonna be having to learn in order for you to successfully pass the exam. Now, 90 minute exam, 55 to 65 questions, 125 USD in order to take it. Not too bad, right? It's a, a third of the price of CCNA. 
So what do you do now? Like, for example, let's say you've already knocked out CCT and you're like, hey, Rob, I'm already there. Well, I wanna, I need to do more. What's my next step? That, that's my question whenever I pass certification. What's the next step? Well, the next step is in the description, there's a link to nextgent.com. Nextgent.com has a number of really awesome trainers. And what we do is we help you through a, a process of both project and certification courses. So we help you understand how technologies work, and then we have projects to help you actually implement them to see how they actually would work. So we're a, basically a double bang for your buck when it comes to how everything gets put together. So definitely check out nextgent.com if you are looking for the next step in your certification process. I'm Rob Riker, instructor and mentor here at NextGenT, and thanks for stopping by.